Hi y'all, it's Neva for Manic Mama Musings and I am so sorry that I've been missing, but the la I believe the last mental health I did was about being manic. Sorry, my eyes are all puffy. I've not been crying. I just don't feel good. Um, but uh, it's Mental Health Monday and yeah, the last time I believe was about being manic. Well, I'm far from manic. I am really depressed, like severely depressed to the point it makes me sick. I can't watch anything without getting distracted and bored. I don't want to crochet. I'm, I haven't made videos because to be honest, guys, I don't know what to talk to y'all about except for me being depressed. So I got to think up some things. But today is Mental Health Monday, so we'll talk about it. Um, I don't know if it's my new meds or what's going on with me, but I'm in a very dark place. And I don't mean like when I was in pain a lot, I told y'all, like, I don't necessarily want to hurt myself. I just, if that's the way it was going to be, I just didn't want to exist anymore. Well, now it's, I'm so depressed that I feel like I keep everybody from having fun and I'm not getting my videos done. I just feel like I'm not, I'm a failure right now. This is the way I feel. I'm just, I cry at the drop of a hat. I even, they even up, I think it's the medicine. I really think it's the gabapentin, but I see her on the 30th and that's when she decides whether she's going to keep me on it or not. I'm kind of hoping she says no or that she'll adjust the dose. So I don't know, but, um, as sad as I've been, it's making me crave bad food. That's my comfort thing. Like I don't. I do medicinal marijuana, but that's to sleep. But the one thing that I do, my dog's whining, sorry, she came with us today. Um, but uh, the one thing I, food is what has always made me feel better. And to be honest, I don't mind my diet, but there is nothing I'm craving on my diet that is any of my depression foods, I guess. I don't have none of those except for cheese. I will eat cheese all the time cheese and pickles but you know anyway I wanted a donut real bad this morning so I got one shouldn't have I'm probably gonna regret it because whenever I've realized that I since I've been doing the gluten-free diet that when I do eat something with gluten in it yeah I feel different I feel worse so yeah um I have not been a very good friend uh I, my friend Lisa has called numerous times and I haven't answered and she thinks I hate her. I don't hate her. I just don't feel like talking. That's probably what I need, but it's not what I want to do. I, I get, when I'm on the phone, I don't know. I get anxious a lot of times when I'm feeling like this. Um, so if y'all would just send some positive vibes my way, I would appreciate it. Uh, Depression looks like laziness. I will be honest because I even tell myself I'm lazy. Because all I want to do is sleep and just veg out. I sit there and play a game on my phone for hours. That's about the only thing that I, that I can do that I don't get bored and frustrated with right away. Um, it's not a good place to be to feel this sad. I hate it. Um, I haven't felt this way in a long time. I did a while after my mom died, like I would have spells like this, but, um, I haven't, I, I was doing a lot better last year. In fact, even through the pandemic and stuff, I was doing so much better than I am right now. And I don't know why I don't know if I need to take a trip and get out of my comfort zone experience some things. I don't, I don't know what's going on, you guys. I didn't go to Cruise in Maine, which the way gas is, like to Cruise Maine, we have this big cruising Maine thing every year, um, the uh, music festival, and they had, this time they had a Christian singer, a Spanish band, and they had um, 38 Special. I We're trying to save money to go out of town instead of to concerts, you know, to start our, our van life, our camping life. And uh, so that wasn't on our budget. And then I didn't want to go cruising because I told him that's a waste of gas just to cruise the main street, main street, you know. Now, the night before, 
they did have like a block party where you could just sit and then like the oldies cars were cruising but i didn't go to that either we didn't do any of that i didn't feel up to it lj father's day um i bought him pizza because that's one of his favorite foods and then he went to the shooting range with um my son-in-law and shot some guns and stuff he had a good day i thought about my dad but that is not at all what's causing this I don't know I do miss him um, then there was Juneteenth I didn't do anything special for that I always do yesterday was Juneteenth today is Juneteenth observe the day they observe Juneteenth and um, you know that all the government buildings are shut down if you don't know what Juneteenth is Google it because it's very important it's also called Freedom Day it's when they celebrate their freedom from slavery, when black, when we should all, there you go, we should all be celebrating the end of slavery. So it's not just a black thing. We should all be happy that it ended. We should all celebrate it. Um, but for like my kids, it's a cultural thing. And they, the twins went and had dinner at my oldest daughter's house um, to celebrate Juneteenth and I could have gone and I didn't go. Um, I need to crochet. I just don't. I've, I've still got to do my collab with Kenyatta. I haven't finished my deal for the Yarnivores theme. That, and the, we're already into June 20th. I'm really sucking this month like bad. I have not worked on my, my mood snake in a long time. So I may skip these parts that I didn't do. And just go when I start again I don't know because I mean that that does tell I didn't write my moods down and it does kind of tell how I was because I was just not present in the moment to do the snake so um, I missed Deborah's birthday giveaways all her videos I feel bad I meant to watch them all and I did not I I uh, I don't even know if I'll post this because it just seems sad, but that's how I feel. Um, I feel like I'm underwater and I can't get to the top to breathe. I feel like I'm suffocating and I don't know what to do. To be honest, I wish I could win the lottery and I just buy a brand new vehicle and take off. That's what I would do. Go visit a bunch of places I always wanted to visit and be on my merry way, but I'm never winning the lottery because I don't play. Um, so is anyone else feeling this? Like, I don't know. I'm just, I don't know if it's just the way the world is nowadays or it's, a, I don't know what's causing it. Um, my therapist doesn't know what's going on. He is trying to help me figure it out. He thinks it's the medication. I'm pretty sure that's what it is, but because I'm not thinking about hurting myself, I'm going to stay on it till the 30th. But I really think that it's the medication. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, old me, drinking me, would be drunk right now. Well, not right this minute, but I'd be trying to get drunk and not be sad. So I'm proud of myself for not trying to do that. Sorry, I'm watching the people in the parking lot. Um, we're parked, and LJ ran in to the store real quick. We had to get gas in the van, and the tire was low, so we had to put air. So am I the only one feeling this right now? I feel, I feel all alone, even though I'm not. I have people checking up on me all the time, and those people that check up on me, I want to tell you thank you so much. And my subscribers that have stayed and not given up on me, thank you. Um, if you're having trouble, you can email me if you're struggling. Um, maybe we can comfort each other. Uh, I thought about not making this video, but I haven't made a video in a long time. And this is the reality of mental illness, is that you have times like this. Um, I don't know. Uh, what's going on with me. I keep saying that, I know. Um, 
I'm hoping to get my crow Joe back soon. I've been trying to work on things little by little, but usually I'd sit there and, okay, I'm going to at least finish this part of something. No, I crochet for maybe 30 minutes and I'm done and it's not getting anything done. And then there's other days that I don't do anything and other days I could sleep all day and all night. And like I said, it looks like laziness, but I really don't want to be like this. I don't try to make myself get up and do things and then it ends up a disaster and I have a panic attack so yeah I'm not sure what's causing this but uh I wish it would go away and so I could just really use all your if you're a praying person pray for me if you are not but you know just send me something positive energy healing vibes prayers good thoughts um maybe I just need to make something out of kindness to send to somebody who knows uh, but yeah, um, I need to get on the ball because I'm so close to a thousand and all of a sudden I hit this depression. We're fine. He's kind of, she wants her dad. If you can wonder why my dog is crying, she wants her dad. She seems to think she has to be with him like all the time. When he goes to work is when she goes to bed and goes to sleep. Doesn't snuggle with me. He gets home from work. She snuggles with him. Hmm. Could be the way I'm feeling though. Maybe she senses it and senses it and she's like, eh. Whatever. So I am gonna end this. I'm gonna try to make some short videos and maybe a few in a day since I already started making videos. There's my honey. Hey, so hey, I love y'all and um, take care. And I hope that y'all aren't feeling what I'm feeling. Let's see if I can Oh, there you go. Are you in there? Yep. There's baby. 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 See? Huh. She wanted him. That's what she wanted. Yeah. Go figure. Okay. I'm signing off. Bye, guys.